And a minute with Alan. Today I'm going to talk about psychologists. Most people enter psychology, I am sure, especially as clinicians and therapists, to heal themselves, to figure out their own problems. Who told me this? Well, the president of the American Psychological Association, who used to be on my board of directors before I got fired. And I will say to you that there's a guy on LinkedIn who is emblematic of this, okay? I know this guy for a long time, and he's always demanding that he gets what he wants and everybody else is wrong. He used to have a client who cracked ice with his teeth when he took a drink, and uh, this guy said to me, it's driving me crazy. I said, just live with it. It's only for a few seconds. Well, of course he couldn't. And he had to bring it up to the guy. He said to me once he was unhappy because I congratulated him and someone else in the same manner and they should have been separated. And whenever I post something on LinkedIn or my technical team recycles one of my articles, he's there saying, I demand to know what facts you have. I demand to see an example. I demand to see your research. Yeah, demand this. Some people are like that. They're so self-absorbed, they're going to implode. And I include here the people at my health club who insist on talking to my trainer when he's spotting me. And they're mostly women. I'm sorry, but it's true. That's self-absorption. And this guy's self-absorbed. What he hasn't realized is that I know how to unlink. Have a nice day. Keep smiling. And stop expecting more than you're entitled to.